नमस्ते हमेशा खुश रहो बेटिया आई जे वी एन प्रीति सिंह फैकल्टी ऑफ फार्मास्यूटिकल साइंस ज्योति विद्यापीठ वुमेन्स यूनिवर्सिटी टुडे आई विल डिस्कस अबाउट द टॉपिक नेजो पल्मोनरी ड्रग डिलीवरी सिस्टम दिस टॉपिक बिलोंग्स टू द सब्जेक्ट नेम नॉवल ड्रग डिलीवरी सिस्टम थ्योरी फॉर द बी फॉर्म सेवन सेमेस्टर so now we come to the what is the introduction of nasopulmonary administration of drug through nasal route is called as nasal drug delivery system in ancient times the indian ayurvedic system of medicines used nasal route for administration of drug and process is called as nasya karma it is best route to achieve faster and higher level of drug absorption uh it is an ideal alternative to the to the parenteral for systemic drug delivery so the drug are administered to the nasal cavity for localized and systemic action and second one is vaccine delivery to see is possible direct nose brain delivery nasal secretion 1500 to 2000 ml per day and the goblet cell uh, nasal glands and lacrimal glands so the composition is 95% water and 1 to 2% salt and 2 to 3% mucin and trace amount sodium potassium calcium and albumin so the nasal enzymes mono oxygenase lactate and dehydrogenase phosphate and hydrolase esterase etc So the nasal pH uh, pH is 5.5 to 6.5 adults and 5.0 to 6.7 infants and children. So the advantages of uh, this nasopulmonary drug delivery system: non-invasive route, first pass metabolism is absent, and rapid drug absorption. So the quick onset of action. and the bioavailability of larger drug molecule can be improved by mean of absorption enhancer so the better nas uh, better nasal uh, bioavailability for a smaller drug molecules convenient route uh, when compared with parenteral route for a long term therapy so the what is the limitations of nasopulmonary drug delivery system the limitation of this absorption surface area is less than compared to git and once the drug administered can not be removed and nasal irritation risk of local side effects so the factors affecting drug absorption molecular weight absorption decreases significantly if the molecular weight is greater than 1000 daltons except with the use of absorption enhancer so the effect of perfusion rate perfusion rate of increase nasal absorption in first and then reaches a plateau level uh, than the independent of the perfusion rate so the effect of perfusion volume as the volume increase first order disappearance rate of phenobarbital from the perfusion solution has been observed to decrease so the effect of solution ph nasal absorption of ph dependent absorption is higher at ph lower then pka and absorption reduces reduces at ph higher than pka so the particle size it has been reported that particle size 10 to 20 micrometer are uh, deposited in the nasal cavity and particle which are less than 2 micrometer can be retained in the lungs and particle of greater than 20 micrometer size exhaled with air so the effect of drug concentration nasal absorption of one tyrosine dependent on its concentration so the mechanism of absorption mostly a uh, drug uh, are absorbed by the passive diffusion and some may be uh, active transport such as amino acid literature shows that up to 1000 dalton uh, drug get easily absorbed with help of help of penetration enhancer so this is the session uh, this is the sum of session of this system nasopulmonary so this session is powered by the digital version 2.0 jyoti vidyapeet women's university and i hope you are satisfied 
with my digital session. If you have any query, please mention in comment box. I will resolve it your problem by the problem resolving class. Thank you and thank you for the listening.